welcome back everybody and yep this is part two of fun in the sun at the west coast on the labor day weekend that we bought a tube to pull it behind the island hopper and we had a great time the kids loved it and i loved it myself loved it so much that i almost killed myself but it was worth it because i had a lot of fun and it made me feel young again but i knew that the next day i was really gonna feel it but it was worth it because i had a great time making memories with my kids so after a few hours of tumbling and killing ourselves we headed in to continue our day all right so here we go for the next adventure for the day oh look who's here look who decided to join us la senorita i had a good night's sleep and a good morning sleep so I feel good. So while we were out there killing ourselves in the inner tube, she was here at the house, sleeping. Vámonos. Oh, how convenient. Ogita slept the whole night and then the whole morning till we got back at 1.30. So you know, she's well rested. But us, we're all beat up, full of bruises and scratched up. But it's okay, we're the water warriors and we're gonna keep going. And especially today, because we're going to a new place. But I guess Gabby's taking advantage of the nice cushion in the front and she's taking a break. Because believe it or not, she rode the tube the longest. And can anyone guess what is Ogita doing on the phone? Again. And cruising out of the canal from the house, it kind of reminds me of that place in Italy. What is it called? Venice? Where they take you around in one of them canoe looking things with a guide? Well, I guess it feels the same. And I guess the scenery is a little different. And instead of using a paddle to push along, we actually use an outboard. I guess for the Kito's feeling tired now because he joined Gabby in the front. And yes, you are hearing correctly. We're jamming old school freestyle diamond girl. All right, guys. So normally, we well, once we go on the on the river. We hit south and we go to Sanibel, Fort Myers, all that place. And now we're actually heading north on the river. And I don't know, never been north, but we're gonna check it out. It's gonna be a new adventure for all of us. And the good thing is, is it's gonna be a flat ride. Yeah, we're gonna hit north on the river and we're gonna go to uh, downtown Fort Myers and check it out, see what we can find. All right, so once again, we're back, we're back with a native friend, Raulito in La Casa. We're gonna hang out. He's gonna take us on a tour, private tour of Fort Myers. So let's go, go and show. And this is Veterans Parkway. This is the North causeway that goes into Cape Coral. And once again, we got Joel at the helm while Frequito and Gabby take a nap in the front cushion. And me and Ogita just sealaxing in the back, enjoying the ride. And we kept going north and I noticed that there were some beautiful, huge homes along the bank of the river. And also noticed that we were riding on brackage water. And this water comes from Lake Okeechobee.
Oh, so far so good. The ride been pretty interesting because I love exploring new places and especially when it has to do on the water. And the cool thing about this river here that it cuts through Florida from the east to the west and it meets in the center in Lake Okeechobee. And maybe one day I'll keep riding north and go to Lake Okeechobee because there's another tiki bar to have lunch at and I think it'll be a really cool trip. And before you guys say anything, I'm not mad. I'm just squinching my eyes because it's so sunny and hot that I could barely keep them open. And look, Ogita has a towel over her because just the shade of the tea top is not enough. And I can't wait to get to the place because it has a pool and I can't wait to jump in and cool off. And so far we're about 25, 30 minutes into the ride, but we don't have that much longer to go. Finally, we have reached our destination and the place looks pretty big and it looks like it has plenty of dockage But my thing is the food because I am really hungry for all that fun in the morning with the kids When we got back, it was like 1.30, but we didn't have lunch So right now my stomach is screaming cold red because it is super hungry So we're gonna dock up and tie up and find the pool and order some food right away Well, so far from the outside, the place looks pretty nice. So let's double check. Let's double check on the boat. Make sure it doesn't hit the dock and go right in. Now look at this. The pool area looks really nice and refreshing. It's just what the doctor ordered on this super hot day. Yeah, I think they got alligator bites. Hold on, hold on. Let's, on. Let's drink. I want to get a drink. <laughs> well, the day must be hot and special because Ogita ordered a adult drink. And we didn't much even let the waiter walk away. We ordered our food, but we decided while we wait, go take a look around at this great looking place. Well, the drink must be really good because sometimes Ogita leaves it behind when she doesn't like it, but I guess this one she does. Right away, if you're a drinker, this is a perfect place because the bar seems pretty big. But we're gonna skip it for now and go towards the water view. And right away, we noticed they have dockage for big boats, medium boats, and little boats. And if you don't have a boat and you want to come here, you can also get here by car because they have access from the road. Look at this, this must be the sports room because they have a huge TV. I guess this is the perfect place for game day. Oh, 
Well, I don't know about you guys, but I think this place is really cool. And they have really cool, awesome photo spots. And you know Gita's gonna find them right away. Well, definitely, Ogita took advantage of the cool photo spots. But you know what? A friend of mine is saying, yo, did you forget about me? Because remember, I'm still hungry. So we're going to head back to our spot, and uh, hopefully the food will come shortly. And surely it did. And guess what? We ordered something special. Well, Frequito did. We got Gator Bites. I can't wait to taste them. But for starters, we got our favorite, Clown Chowder Soup. And sometimes I ask myself, if this is a family boating channel or a food family boating channel because I notice I find myself talking about food just as much as boats yeah what you got girl Wow, she got some shrimp with wrap with bacon. Look at that. What you got? You got a salad? Love it. I don't know, I feel like eating salad. Well, the clam charter was great. The alligator bites, a little spicy for my taste, but it was still pretty good. After all that, good food, it's time to get wet and cool off in the pool. Well guys, what do you think about the place? We? Well, me. I love it. Good food, swimming pool, and a hot day. I mean, it doesn't get better than this. And to top it off, it's a pretty good ride to get here and a pretty cool ride to get back. And it wasn't that far. I want to calculate it's probably between 30 to 40 minutes. And talking about the ride back, I think we should get going. Catch. So check it out, guys. Pretty cool place up the river to come hang out, catch a little snack, jump on the pool, or a few drinks if you're a drinker. So it's pretty nice. Check it out. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Another place to come hang out here on the west side. Pretty cool. I got plenty of boat parking too. So we're, we're almost ready to go. Back to the house. Nice, pretty. So what do you guys think about the place? Do you like it, this place? What are you guys eating? What are you guys eating? Oh, you guys went shopping in the backyard, got some mangoes? Oh, y'all want some? So we're eating homemade backyard dessert, mangoes. Well, the mango was really good because it was nice and cold. And you know what else was good? Some of the comments that I've been reading on the previous video of us going on that into. And yes, most of the people were laughing at the video. And me too. I was also laughing at myself because it was a crazy ride. And then from that, we wanted up here, up the river, at this really cool Tiki Hut restaurant that the food was really good. And the best part, we got to jump in the pool and cool off. But now it's time to hit back down the river to the house but we're gonna take it slow and enjoy the ride and the scenery and once again it was a great pleasure sharing this labor day weekend with you guys and also i would like to say thank you for raulito for taking us to this really cool place